How's it everybody? Gabe here from the Hawaii Institute of Self-Reliance. Thank you for watching. Welcome back. Today is a mail call video. I got my Okapa 16 inch blade machete out of 1055 steel with a plastic handle and a lanyard hole and I believe it is full tang. You can kind of see the metal right there and this is going to be a first impression and test video. Stick around. See what I think about this South African machete. Yeah. The quick stats on this machete it's a 16 inch blade I'm not quite sure of the coating it seems to be some kind of paint but it held it's held up pretty good so no complaints there and 21 inches overall the blade thickness is 0 0.08 inches and it weighs about 14 ounces and it does not come with the sheath. Would I recommend the Okapa machete? Yes. It's a pretty nice machete. 1055 steel. Sharpens up real easy. I do have a gripe about the grind. It was the worst grind I've ever seen. I'm used to sharpening machetes from companies that uh, don't sharpen the machetes. A lot of companies uh, do that, like Latin machetes. Um, they don't come sharpened, and that's because you want to put on your own edge and that's what they figure and this is the worst I've never seen it that bad but 1055 steel made it real easy sharpened up real quick seems to hold an edge I like it I would recommend it it was $19 it might be a little bit on the pricey side but it's not made in China it's made in uh, South Africa which is kind of unique that's kind of why I got it because I've never had a machete from South Africa so <laughs> I picked one up $19 to my door uh, reasonable it does not come with the sheath I kind of wish it came with the sheath I would have paid like an extra dollar or two for a sheath but I'll just make mine out of something probably not kydex I'll probably make it out of Kodora or something some old backpack uh, that's all tore up I'll scavenge some of that material to make a sheath for this it is worthy uh, this coating I think is a paint I'm not quite sure but it seems to hold up I like that I dig that a lot because it'll protect from rust and I don't have to constantly be using it or oiling it I can actually just worry about the edge so I like that that's another cool feature and this orange handle I like that that's really nice 
there was some fit and finish problems and I just sanded it down, got it all nice, not that hard to smooth out this uh, injected molded plastic handle. And I believe it is full tang, like I was saying, uh, or at least to here, which is fine with me. It held up in my testing over the past couple days. And I like how there's a lanyard hole. It's covered by this uh, Wilson's tennis uh, ball or tennis racket tape uh, right now. But uh, I like that option. In the beginning of the video, I, I show uh, the machete without my modifications. And so that's what I've done. I've wrapped this to give it just a little bit more security. Uh, most of my machetes, I do wrap with some kind of uh, grip tape. Uh, just because it gets wet in the jungle and I use my machetes a lot and I like them to be secure in my hand. Now it is blade heavy. I like that. It feels real good in the hand. I'm not afraid it's going to slip out. You know, it, it's, it's a nice machete. And I like how it's 16 inches. Not too many machetes are 16 inches. They're usually, you know, 12 inches uh, or 18 or above, you know, like 24 or 21. So I think the 16 inch machete is one of the best uh, lengths for a backpacking or a camp machete. I just believe that this length is a good style. Uh, it gives you enough uh, length to clear trail, but it's not too long to get in the way of, uh, uh, you know, like if you're in a survival situation, you might want something that's a little bit easier to carry and not so uh, encumbersome you know and you can in the jungle you can make smaller strokes and have a little tighter area sometimes the jungle gets real tight and you don't want to be clearing this huge trail with this big machete uh, i like these smaller machetes i think the best uh, for a survival or a camp machete or a bushcraft machete I think would be in between 14 and 18 inches. So this is perfect with the 16 inch blade. Woo, I like it. I would recommend it. I'm gonna make a sheath for it. You know, it works pretty good. I like it. it. Takes an edge real nice. Now, I'll put a link in the description box where you can buy this. I got mine off of Amazon. And I hope you check it out. It's a fairly good deal, $19, like I said. And I hope you like this video. I hope this helped in a purchase decision. Please comment. I love all your comments. And subscribe for further videos. And until next time, aloha!